Hi there, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Today we're gonna to take a quick look at this D-Max Over the Hub Rotor Disc Brake Kit. Now this kit is going to give you two of these slip-on over the hub rotors that will fit over your Dexter idler hubs. Now this will allow you to upgrade your trailer from an idler axle to a braking axle so that your trailer can slow and stop itself rather than relying on your tow vehicle to slow and stop both. So it is definitely gonna take uh, less toll on your uh, tow vehicle's braking system. Uh, these brakes are going to work for a 7,000 pound capacity axle. Our brake flange on the back side here does have a five bolt hole configuration. So it is gonna be very simple to get mounted on your axle. Our rotors are 13 and 1 8th of an inch in diameter. And you can see we've got these 9 16th inch uh, wheel bolt holes here and the eight on six and a half inch bolt pattern. Uh, so it's going to allow your Dexter Idler Hub's original wheel studs to uh, fit right in there and it's gonna hold it in place. And these do have a max coat finish. Uh, the max coat is kind of a proprietary version of a, a dichromat finish. So these are gonna hold up really well. It's got a salt spray rating of over 1000 hours. So these will work great for your boat trailers or trailers that are used in coastal areas or on heavily treated roads where they're gonna be in, coming in contact with a lot of road salt and that sort of thing. Uh, so these are gonna hold up really well for you. Now, if you are upgrading from an idler axle to a braking axle, you are going to need to have a hydraulic brake actuator and brake lines that are rated for 1500 PSI or higher in order to activate these brakes. And that's gonna take some, some doing to get that all installed. Uh, if you don't already have those components, we do have them. Uh, we sell them available. <laughs> we sell them separately here at eTrailer.com. So uh, be sure to uh, pick those up as well. And even though it is gonna take quite a bit uh, to get that all installed, I definitely think it's gonna be worth it for you. The performance that these disc brakes offer is going to give you sh sh dramatically shorter stopping distances, uh, having the brakes on your trailer, but especially with these disc brakes, we do have ceramic brake pads here that help to increase the stopping power. And then there is a large two and a half inch diameter stainless steel piston that provides fast responsive braking for you. So it's going to uh, give you much shorter stopping distances and a nice smooth controlled braking experience. In addition to great performance, these are also going to require very minimal maintenance. So it is gonna help save you some time and money. You can see on the side here, we do have this vented design that's gonna help dissipate heat and it's gonna help pre prevent premature brake pad wear. Now your brake pads will wear down over time. You will have to replace those eventually, uh, but it's a pretty straightforward process to get those swapped out. Uh, another thing that sets D-Max apart from other disc brakes is that we've got these holes in the hat section here. Uh, so those holes are going to prevent any water or uh, condensation from sitting inside, potentially corroding uh, the metal surface there. So that's gonna help, again, make these nice high quality. D-Max is really focused on creating quality products. Uh, so these are gonna be, in my mind, uh, kind of the top of the line. Uh, the, when you're looking at your good, better, best, as far as finishes go, uh, the Max coating, the chromate the coating uh, comparable, I'd say they're probably uh, good, better kind of set up. So uh, your best is definitely gonna be stainless steel uh, construction that's gonna resist the most corrosion. Um, but this is definitely still gonna be really good for you, especially in those really corrosive environments. And one last thing I do wanna point out is that here on the back side of our calipers, they do have uh, laser etched instructions uh, for uh, installing and bleeding the brakes. So it's gonna help take some of that guesswork out of it for you and to make sure that everything is installed properly. So overall, if you are wanting to upgrade your Dexter idler hubs so that you have a braking axle, uh, this is gonna be a great way to go. That completes our look for today. Again, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Thanks for watching.